Welcome back, guys. I'm about to deal with the monkeys again. That's where we left off last time. I got killed by some monkeys. <laughs> so we're picking up there, and I'm going to try to kill them with a grenade launcher. There's Billy. Here we go. <laughs> you are wasting your time. I have already claimed this place for myself, which means you are trespassing. All right, and let's skip I... this. Poor monkey's been beaten up. He's got all these wounds on him. This to be the real identity of that crazy young man. Impossible. Let's skip it. I'm coming. Dun, 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 dun. No, no, no. Go, go, go. Yeah, run past it. <laughs> the monkeys that are in the room with Rebecca are the ones I think I'm going to try to kill. I think I have to. I don't... There was like three of them in there. I don't know if I can get past them. Can I just skirt right around them? I doubt it. We'll try that next time if this doesn't work. Oh, oh, right. Oh, no, no, no. Yeah, there's ammo and gas in there, but... I Let's just let's just do, focus on this for now. I can't see them. Oh no! There they are. Oh no! I'm like stunned. He's gonna go down. Oh, look at this. He won't do anything. Well, what I was trying to do there was run into the room more so I could see if they were still- I didn't want to just- evil. Zero. <laughs> I didn't want to just keep shooting if they were down. I didn't want to waste ammo. Ammo is very precious. <laughs> so that's what was going on in my head in that moment. Like move into the room so we actually have some visibility, but maybe I don't do that. Maybe I just keep shooting. But there's three of them. I don't think I can go around them. I don't think I can. And they stun you. Like you get hit by one and then he's just, he won't move. Like that wasn't me just deciding to not move. That was Billy who couldn't move. All right. Well, uh, I'll see you in a moment when I catch back up and I get to that same spot that I picked up on <laughs> at the beginning of the video. That was quick. Here we go again. We're just going to start shooting like I did last time. That's, okay, ooh. I was gonna say, that looks like it hit the wall. Just keep going. Oh no, I didn't shoot fast enough. Fuck. Sorry, I didn't mean to swear like that. <laughs> I do that in some videos, I don't know why. I just got bummed out about that now. Alright. Gonna come out of the menu, and we're gonna try. To hit him. He's right there, though. Is he dead? He's getting back up. All right, I don't think there's more. Okay, we got them all. Uh, Bex? You can see Rebecca down below. She looks like she could fall at any moment. Gotta save her before it's too late. What do I... Oh, no. I don't see a timer. There's a rope here. There's lots of rope. Yeah, I don't... I get it's a torture device. I don't care about that. I want the... I want... I'm trying! 
All right, so we got past the monkeys, but now what? Oh my God. Rope right here, come on, come on. All this rope. I don't know. Maybe we go to the boiler room? Crap, how do we even get there? I don't remember. Okay, I think I remember, actually. Yeah, the only reason I came in here and dealt with the monkeys and wasted all of those grenades was so that I could come save her. I, I didn't, okay, yeah. I guess you don't come back in this room. I didn't realize. Please let that be it for the monkeys. Oh god. Oh no 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 no. And there's all that ammo on the table. I'll have to come back to that. Come back for that. Flustered. <laughs> Please let there be nobody else on the way, because he's gonna die. Except I know um the room I have to go through to get to the boiler room. I think, if I'm remembering correctly where it is, it has a bunch of zombies in it, which I have killed. But I can't remember if I've killed them since saving. Like, I might have died and then not come back in here to kill them. Oh, I tried so hard! I really didn't die, at least. And there's another guy. No! <laughs> Oh, thank goodness. Oh, Billy, you're so strong. I love you. <laughs> thank you for being so strong. Watch, this isn't even going to be the right room. It is. It is. It is. We're good. Who suddenly is in here now, though? Ooh, heals. Yes, please. Well, I can't combine them without Rebecca. Ah, can't even take them all. First time coming through here. Hey, there we go. Yes, we're going downstairs. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> okay. Okay. We're gonna have to redo it all. Just, just watch. Oh my god, there's a second one? Are you kidding me? Alright, well now I know we don't need to go back into that room. That changes things. Yeah, we'll still have ammo. I did take at least one hit from that monk. I might have taken uh, two hits from the monkey when I went to that room that I just learned I don't need to go into. We just go straight to the boiler room. All right. I'll see you as we're... <laughs> I will see you... At in a second when I am running to the boiler room. <laughs> okay, here we go again. We're in the boiler room. Go run past the herbs this time. We'll come back for them or something. I don't know. I'm gonna go for the monkeys. I'm gonna try to kill them because this it looks like there's a lot of stuff in this room, so I'm gonna have to take them. Like, I can't explore the room after we get Rebecca. Okay, where's the other one? Come on, show your face! Oh my god, there's three! Wait, hold on. Ah, uh, <laughs> they almost got me. Yeah, we can hold more than six at a time. Oh, fuck you. 
I don't trust that it's not coming back, though. All three of them are down. Okay. Now. Oh, bullets. Now, is she in this room? Or that room? Don't want to go through another room just yet. I want to go through the room that I know she's in. Okay, so turn to the right. She's through here. We'll catch you, Rebecca! Just let go. Almost oh god, is there gonna be a monkey in here? Please don't be. Oh. Rebecca! Oh, she was really hanging. I thought she was like hanging from the ceiling. Hang on. I'll pull you up. I guess if she was, then she probably wouldn't have gotten too hurt if she just let go. <laughs> There's a typewriter in here. Thank you. Don't mention it. Just keeping my word. We promised to cooperate with each other. Remember? Who's that? This is Rebecca, over. Rebecca, this is Enrico. Enrico. Have you managed to locate Cohen yet? Over. Rebecca, answer me. No, sir. I have not found him yet. Ooh. I'll continue to search for him. Over. She lied for him. Rebecca. My first mission, and I've already disobeyed orders. So much for my great law enforcement career. Oh well, I probably won't live long enough to worry about it. Billy, I just need to know. I need to know the truth. Did you kill 23 people? I'm not going to judge you. I just want to know so the truth. I need to know your body count before we move forward. It was around this time last year. Our unit was ordered to Africa to intervene in a civil war. Our mission was to raid a hideout of some guerrilla forces located deep inside the jungle. But the hideout was yeah. far away from our entry point. Controller's vibrating on my thigh. were killed by the enemy. In the end, only four of us survive. Only, there was no guerrilla hideout. What do you mean? The idiots in charge had us operating based on wrong information. But we couldn't just go back home empty-handed, oh no. Our leader ordered us to attack an innocent village. Hmm. Oh, it's really vibrating on my thigh. Tickle. Get rid of them! Kill them all! Please, sir! Cease fire immediately! Shut up! Ugh. Oh. Do it! Oh. No! Don't stop! So did you execute those innocent people? Forget about it. Doesn't matter anymore. Well, that was then. Not. This is now. Besides, you said you wouldn't judge me. I'm not judging you, but it does matter. Look. Now my people think you killed those MPs in the van, but I don't think you did. It was those zombie dogs, right? When they attacked the van, you were able to escape. Isn't that right? You don't get it. I've only got two choices left. Either report to the Marines and serve out my sentence, or keep on running for as long as I can. That's all. Oh, okay. And they're giving me some ink ribbies. Let's take, let's save. I'm not doing that again. No way. Um, I was just thinking. We're probably going to have to go back through that one room with all the zombies, the little, uh, banquet looking room. 
And we've got those heels. I can't believe they're not giving me any more than that, though. That's just wild. Wooden box looks like it was once filled with gunpowder. Um, yeah, let's go back over here. Rebecca has uh, danger status. Billy's health is really low, too. I don't want to have to bring them both through that room. Yeah, he's in caution. Um, yeah, just equip this for now. And I'll go alone. Roger. Yeah, you stay there for now, Rebecca. Yeah, I just don't know what to do with the heels that I'm able to pick up in a moment. Ooh. It got me. Can you die already? Jeez. Poison. We have some blue herbs. Actually, I think Rebecca has them. Where is it? Just die. Goodness gracious. All right, hold on. Let's go back through here because I believe I had her pick up the blue herb. Yeah, I don't I don't know if I want to give it to uh, Billy or Rebecca, the green ones. Oh, there you are. Because. Yeah, she, I did have her give it to him. Um, I'm going to be using him more. I'm going to use Billy as long as I don't need to use Rebecca because he's just so much better. <laughs> but she's also in danger. I don't want to risk her dying. Tough decision. I don't know. Maybe we'll find another heal soon and then I won't have to be in this freaking Sophie's Choice situation here. All right, there's a door there, but it's around the corner. Boot for movement. Two doors. Let's see. Looks like I can go through them both. Start with the single door. That doesn't sound good. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Did I just run out of ammo? No, I didn't! Can I- Ah, uh, it's such a shame to use this on them, but I want whatever they're guarding, you know? Oh, we missed! That sucks. Oh, could have taken them out way quicker. Yeah. And we're in danger. And uh, we might end up needing to reload. <laughs> We got the locker key. I know you don't want to use something like that on an enemy that's not super powerful. They're not like zombie level. They're a little bit above that. Like they're not as easy to take out as a zombie, but not as difficult as like those freaking monkeys. Who's in here? Oh wait, this looks familiar. No, I haven't been in here, right? Oh. Well, there's some replacement ammo, but how do we get to it? Definitely can't interact with any of these things on the wall. That looks like a... This might not be anything, but we're gonna try. Looks like a candle. Okay. It's nothing. Yeah, see how this one's lit? Like, this torch on the wall is lit, and then that one back there is not oh more ammo good 
more ammo. Okay. I don't care about that. Stop telling me. I just want the ammo. I'm here for the goods. And let's equip this again. Oh, shotgun shells. And there's something else. Bexter's come meet me. I wanna leave her just you know, just stay put unless I need her as like a pack mule. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry that that is your lot, but it's just strategy, you know? Nothing personal, Beck. We go through... Yeah, that's right. We went through this door. But yeah, just keep her in a safe place until... Oh, wait. No, this wasn't the room. Until we need her inventory slots. Okay, just... I mean, I shoot, I shoot those guys with the handgun, and I shoot them a bunch of times, and they don't go down. And then I end up taking a bunch of damage while shooting them, since they don't go down after so many shots. Alright, pick that up. And Billy, go over here. There's something in this little cabinet. There we go. Mag- Oh, Magnum! We haven't found the gun itself, but yeah, we'll take that. For now. Oh, and then he's got the locker key. Come over here. And... Ah. What is it? Is in his inventory full? Duralumin. Dur. Dural. Duralumin. I don't know what that word is. Why'd you just take that? Turn dial? Oh, we don't know the combo. It's 909. Imagine if I really just guessed it on the first try. That would never happen. Well, this isn't something we looked at recently, was it? Mm. I don't think so. We have a lot of files to sift through, you know. I don't think there was anything that I found that I... Like, I remember that poem now, that verse of poetry. Remember there was that 815? I've already used that on the clock. Um, I don't know what... Yeah, this one. <laughs> I don't know what we'll end up doing with that verse of poetry, but... Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like we just sometimes pick things up that are useful for moments like this, but when you go a few days without playing, you're not going to remember all, all of those. I'm just going to assume that we haven't done anything with that yet. Or haven't received that code yet, and we're going to have to come back here. <sighs> Control panel, press a button. Oh. Left, right, center, or don't touch. Oh, the don't touch option is really making me think that I should probably leave it alone until I know what it does. I think this is a situation where we need to use both of them, so it's good that we call Rebecca here. Oh, right. Is there anything else in here? No? Okay. Let's go give her an item or two, and then... There we go. <laughs> and then, uh, 
Grab that, and then we'll have her press buttons. Here, you come up over this way, actually. Just get ready to stand right here. Yes. And take... Oh my god, I didn't even realize she only picked up one of those magnum bullets. That's kind of lame. I guess take these for now. All right, Bills. Let's go. Now that we have made our way in here... Let's explore the rest. Uh, press the left again. It looks like he's still trapped. Well, he's especially trapped now. <laughs> Rebecca's like, I did it! I got him! I got the prisoner! The escaped prisoner! Okay. Press the center one. Okay. <laughs> now, press the... Right one? I don't know if the left one will lower that gate that's in front of him. It didn't look like it did, so press the left one. There we go. We're making our way through here. Definitely nothing in this corner. Yeah. Alright. I think the center one that down. Yeah. Oh look, I can move him still. Well obviously I can, but it's funny that you can see him moving around. I'm not gonna do it that way though. Those guys look, it looks like the those bugs, but it looks like they're carcasses. Just shiny in there. Press the button. Can I read the message above it first? Underground Cable. I cannot read the rest of that. Battle sequence initiated. Locking door. Oh, is that a hunter? Uh oh. Oh no. Ah! I didn't even have a chance. Not a single moment. This game. This game's so hard. Ugh. I didn't have a moment. A single moment. Resident Evil Zero. To even move. Like sweat. It's not hot in here. It's a little warm in here, I guess. But I'm sweating. I'm freaking sweating because I'm getting stressed. I fucking love this game though. <laughs> I don't know why I love being tortured like this, but I'm having so much fun. Okay. I'll make another cut, and then we'll get back to that spot. I think I'll go get those heals, though, and heal Billy up. He needs to be at full health when he's dealing with some shit like that. Okay. I will see you back where we just left off before we died. All right, we've made it back. Now, I wonder if I should send him through here first. I don't know why I would necessarily, but I'm just want to try it out and see if it happens. Also don't know which button will lower that cage in front of him. Wasn't that one. Also, I really hope the hunters can't get near where Rebecca currently is. That would be uh, tragic because she's in danger. Oh, not this way. Nothing over here. Um, oh, you know what? Maybe we press that... No, I was gonna... Never mind. I was gonna say press that button and run over here. But it would be nice to have this open space for when the hunters come through. I think we want them to because there's an item there through that gate. Here, let's see. Let me just check one more time. Um, I don't know. Try left. The one that's 
currently blocking Billy's path. I just wanted to see if we go. Oh, okay. It just brings me around again. Oh, yeah. It's just a big circle, clearly. All right. Uh, we are as ready as we'll ever be. So he's in yellow caution. And we've got the grenade launcher. We shouldn't die immediately like he did last time if he gets hit. Let's go all the way as far over as we can. Wait, no, not yet. Can you stand all the way in the corner and press it? No, you gotta be pretty close to it, huh? I just want to be as far away from the hunter as possible. Battle voice scared me again. All right, we were ready. Ready to shoot. I can't see. Oh. I can hear another, though. Oh, God. Oh, right. We're trapped in here with them. Ah! I'm trapped in between them. This is a nightmare. Okay. I thought he was writhing on the floor. Like, did you see the one that was behind him? It was writhing on the floor and then it stayed down. So I'm like, oh yeah, it's fine. And then he got up and then I'm like, oh, he's getting back up. Let me shoot, I was out of ammo. And I know I can, oh my God. I know I can reload. Are you getting back up? No, he's down for good this time. danger yeah so the heal that i took is totally gone like the the effects from it totally gone i would have not survived that had i not taken that heal um yeah that was tough well let's get the item facility key we can access a facility now is there anything in here no that was everything right okay all right, so they don't come for Rebecca. They're... I was thinking about it. I was like, well, were they released somewhere else? Is, or is this the only spot? Yeah, it just sucks because... They're both in danger. Like, what do we do about that? Game won't give me enough heals. There was that. And then the magnum ammo. Oh, crap. Yeah, he's awful. I can't get into the locker because I didn't go back into that room. And I don't want to go in that room because the bad guys are in there and we don't... Well, you know, I don't need to say it again. Uh, Rebecca, you grab the shotgun ammo. You don't have the locker key. Well, I say we just Let's go. Yeah. Keep exploring. And hope we get more heals. We just access this whole downstairs area, this whole bottom of the building or underneath the building. While there's still a bunch of rooms upstairs we haven't accessed. What was that? What's that noise? Yeah, this room right here, that's where we want to get that locker key, but... I mean, we could probably take him out with, um... These acid shells. I don't want to do that, you know? Like, I don't want to waste that on them again. I'm thinking. I'll go alone. Okay. 
Have I gone through here? I don't think I have. Oh, right. This is where we picked up Becca. I say we save. Oh, wait. She's got the ink ribbons, doesn't she? But yeah, we'll save. I've got enough ink ribbons. It's fine. Just so I don't have to keep redoing a bunch of stuff. If we didn't die so easily, I wouldn't save as frequently as I have been. That whole uh, little cinematic about Billy was interesting. I wonder if there's supposed to be like a romantic thing going on between them. Follow me. Yeah. Yep. Actually, no. I'll go. Yeah. Billy will go for now. I always go get the shotgun again and then use the shotgun to kill those bug guys. So there's this room. No amount of cunning can match the speed of my supple limbs. So we got ourselves a puzzle here. I dance freely through the air, capturing a legless prey. Okay. Should I read all of them? I stand tall on the earth, with horns proudly displayed. Okay, hold on. This is locked, what does it say? Six souls imprisoned within the chains of death rekindle the flames of life from the spirits of the weak. The flames of life from the spirits of the weak. Do I... I mean, it's talking about flames, do I put... Based on that description, I doubt it's as simple as this, but... Oh! Okay, so we light that, but maybe we're supposed to do it in a specific order. Or... Only some of them are supposed to be lit. I don't know. We'll just do all of them for now. I hope we don't run out of lighter fluid. Does it tell me? This lighter is full of fuel. Well, it's full, it tells me. So, oops. I'm guessing if we do run out, it won't be anytime soon. Oh, some of them came unlit. Or all of them came unlit. Oh. Let me read that again. Six souls imprisoned within the chains of death. Rekindle the flames of life from the spirits of the weak. Alright, yeah, what are those? Let's look at these descriptions a little bit. The strong prey upon the weaker is what I can read on the little plaque. This says, I am the king of all I survey. No creature can escape my grasp. You're not weak. But imagine a snake wouldn't be weak either. That is not the description of one who is weak. Maybe you're weak? I don't... I don't get this. You're talking about dancing. You're fast, not necessarily strong. Alright, well, you're strong, you're strong, you're strong. <laughs> I don't know if this is how you're meant to think of it, but I'm gonna just try. Uh, lighting the ones that aren't like 
traditionally thought of as strong, I guess. I don't know. Probably won't work, but we'll, we're gonna try. All right, so the horse, the eagle, the deer. And I would think these ones would be the ones that are strong. Rekindle the flames of life from the spirits of the weak. You do the snake too. Is there something else in this room that I'm missing? I don't understand. Is this something that maybe we can't get yet? Maybe we need to discover something else first. I don't know. What I do know is I need heals. And I really not thinking it's likely I'm going to see any anytime soon. Ah, uh, if we want our shotgun, we have to go back through the room. We can't get the shotgun, basically. We have to go back through the room that's got all those zombies. There's too many of them. They mob you. And then I think there was a zombie in this room. Not that I really need to go in there anyway. Okay, well, we got to keep moving forward, so... What we will do is go into the room with the bug guys, get the locker key, get the item from the locker. I don't even remember what it was. What was down this way? Oh, right, right. I keep getting those doors mixed up. Yeah. The other door was where we saved Rebecca. And then this door is where we left her, kind of. All right, I hate to do it, but I think we're going to use these acid shells on the bugs because otherwise if I the only other thing I can use is a handgun and I will get attacked by them while using the handgun. Like I know they have their back to me when I walk in the room, but I still like it, it's just not going to be enough. You will watch me die if I use the handgun. Did you just miss? Okay, well, yeah, I guess you'll watch me die if I use the acid shells. Maybe it's worth using the handgun. I don't even know. Oh, God. Well, it's not... There's actually a situation where I don't need to make a cut. I haven't made any progress. Since my last save. Man. Man. In team mode. Doesn't look like it. Uh, just want to make sure. Oh, yeah, give her some items. Um, I guess. Yeah, give her this. I'll use the handgun on the bugs. I think it's going to be the same thing, though, where I'm going to start shooting and then they're going to come and attack me while I'm shooting. We do have that new key. I don't know what door it would open. And either way, like... Oh my. Um, I have to go through that room with the zombies. How do I get through there when I'm <laughs> my health is so low? We're in a pickle. 
All right, let's see. Just keep shooting, Billy. Don't stop shooting. I'm trying. I was trying to make him run. No! What do you think? We evade. We're just going to try to go around them. We can't kill him. We just can't do it. Zero. It's so hot in this room. <laughs> Every time I die, it just gets hotter in here. Fuck. Man. I wish I could remember what was in that locker because it might just be something that I could just say, screw it, we're not going for it. Do the whole item exchange. problem with trying to maneuver around them is that they are right at where the item is that I need, the, the key. But we'll try. What else do we do? Excuse me. This is weird. Why are they just letting me go around them? Whoa, look, we're doing it. We're doing it. Oh, we did it. <laughs> okay. And we saved ammo. How nice. I did not think it would work. I couldn't, I couldn't believe I was able to just run in front of them right like that. They only started attacking after I picked up the key. Well. That's cool. I just never would have imagined that <laughs> would have been how it went. Yeah. What's in here? Oh, right. Dura lemon. Dura lemon. I don't know where the inflection goes, but whatever. The point is, we got it. Not that I know how to open it. Definitely an important item that we didn't want to forgo. I have no idea what's in it, but I'm sure it's something important. Well, nothing else to do down here. Well, there's the room with the fire, the flames, and the animal statues. It's one thing I've been saying about this game that is actually easier than the first game is uh, the puzzles, but this one actually is not easy. I mean, that poetry isn't related to it, right? I just read it a little bit ago, but I already forget. The moon bows to the earth, the earth swears loyalty to the sun, and the great law of the sun governs all things. This itself is the keystone, the pointer to glory. All our hands cannot open the door to heaven. I think we gotta figure this out now. It says there's something about six, whatever. There's six animals. Is it like an alphabetical order thing? King of all I survey. 
No creature can escape my grasp. Sharp wit allows me to bring down even the greatest horned beast. I mean, there's a horned beast directly across from you. Is that relevant somehow? It's very specific. No amount of cunning can match the speed of my supple limbs. Now, is that related to one of these guys that's supposed to be cunning? Are you supposed to be cunning? Or is that the snake? Really capturing something about legs. Or No, you wouldn't be cunning. Legless silence. Okay. I think I'm on to something here. Yeah, and you're calling yourself a king while one of these guys, I forget which one, said that they can take down a king. Are you the cunning one? Sharp wits, yes. Um, hold on. I need to write this down. I'm not going to remember. Otherwise, but... So the wolf is cunning. Because I still don't even know which... Like, I think we're supposed to light them in a certain order, but I don't... I still don't even know. Let me, I'll read the other message on the door again. Okay, so the horse is speed. I mean, honestly, kind of easy to remember, but there's just too many things to keep track of at once that writing it down is just going to be more simple for me. And then you are the eagle. Um, you dance through the air, legless prey. See, I don't even know what their main thing is. Legless dance air. Face, face it, face it. <laughs> uh, wait, you stand what? Okay, so you stand tall and your horns. So the deer or the stag is a uh, tall horn. I know they've got horns off the top of my head, but I just want to make sure I'm keeping it all straight. And then. You were like this. So you are going to definitely be related to the eagle. So it's, pro it's probably going to be like snake, then eagle, or eagle, then snake. Um, legless creep. You're a legless creep. Oh, and then kings. Great, great, okay. And then you were the king, right? I'm the king of all I survey. Okay, and I don't even know what this is. A panther? We'll just call him a panther. Be like a another big cat, but whatever. Okay, so I wonder. Hmm. I wonder if it's supposed to go in an order like like the eagle or I'm sorry no the snake can get killed by the eagle and then the see even with writing this down I'm struggling so you light the snake then you light the eagle and then who takes down the kings? Oh wait, well, the eagle takes down the panther. We're calling it a panther. I don't know if that's what it's supposed to be. It doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, so... I still don't know. Well, who's talking shit on the cunning one? I know the wolf is cunning. Is it you, horse? No amount of cunning. Okay. 
So the horse <laughs> is greater than the wolf. And then the eagle is greater than the snake. But the snake is greater than the king, who is the panther. And who said the thing about the... Which one of you... Did you say something about the horns? Yeah, so the wolf is greater than uh, I might be overcomplicating the crap out of this but whatever the simple version is isn't coming to me <laughs> uh the greater than the deer so you are greater than the wolf you are greater than the snake you are greater than who are you greater than and tall on the earth with horns proudly displayed. Okay, so you're probably the weakest one. Okay. The snake, greater than the panther. Knowing all this. So I'm gonna say the deer will be first. The deer can't outdo anybody. And who is saying he'll take him down? The wolf. And then who's saying they'll take down the wolf? The horse. Is anybody saying they'll take down the horse? No. Not that I noticed, at least. Um, well, from there... The, ah, but the eagle can take down the snake, but the snake... Okay, so then I think it goes... Panther. Snake. Eagle. Alright, so this is the order I have to light them in. Deer, wolf, horse, panther, snake, eagle. Let's give it a try. Horse is next. And the panther. And the snake. And then the eagle. Okay, so that definitely was not simple, and I, I, can, I really, okay, I thought this was going to be one of those things that I've gotten into, especially a lot in the first game, where I'm like, yeah, this must be how it works, and then I do it, and then it's like, nope, nothing happens. I really didn't expect that to work. I mean, I, I was doing it anyway, because I figured, oh, I got no other plans. Let's not get too happy, though, because uh, I'm probably going to die. Okay, so we can go through this door. I'm sure there's going to be some monster or whatever in here that's going to take me out. If there's an empty bottle. What's that? It's a fireplace. It appears to be purely decorative, but there's something in it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we need those for that uh, room with the big telescope. Probably send Rebecca our pack meal in here. Yeah, I guess we'll take the empty bottle. We have no gas. There is a room that's got gasoline. Nothing else in here. Um, but it had monkeys in it. Do you think those monkeys are still there? Do you think they just went away on their own? I, I doubt they went away on their own.
Okay, let's see what is through this door. Bullets do we have left? 23. Not moving yet. Yep. Okay. Is the other guy gonna get back up? Why is he just hanging out? Several books lie open on the desk. There doesn't seem to be anything special about them. What is this? Management Trainee's Diary. What is it that Director Marcus is researching all the time? And what's with his weird interest in leeches? Interest? Seems more like love at times. <laughs> Rumor has it that there's something dangerous about those leeches. Is it true that when Dennis just touched one, he got ill with a fever? It is true, not is it true. Again, today, there were those horrible moans beyond that door. Let sleeping dogs dot dot dot. No way I'll go near them. Even if the director ordered me, I don't want to end up like Dennis. That poor bastard, <laughs> whoever wrote this, ended up like Dennis. Scratching and scratching. Makes me itch just watching him. Just watching him? Are you getting... You already have it? Must... Yeah, you do. Damn. Must maybe go. If, can, but how. Dennis gone. I go. Hungry. Help. Mom. Uh. What the fuck is the point of that? Just a just to make me feel bad for the person. A wooden box inside our various gadgets and gizmos. What's the point of this little corner? Can you climb on that box? Is there something up there? No? Okay. Hmm. That's all there is to do in this room? I mean, I know we got that. Like, not ready to accept that this room's done. I know we got that, uh, tablet, but... Uh, that puzzle was pretty tricky. I'm just surprised, you know? Surprised that this is all we'd really get. Yeah, Unity. Tablet depicting a knight, the word Unity is inscribed. Well, we've got this facility key, so we can keep going. Uh, just gotta go through the one room. I keep having to like readjust my position because it's so hot in here. I have a ceiling fan in this room, but it, sometimes it gets picked up in the microphone. This is the one we just read, right? Okay. For some reason, I thought that there was a green text in there, and I was like, wait, hold on. Maybe I should note what that green text was. Nothing in there. All right. Hang on. I'm wondering if maybe I save. Can I look at the other rooms? Change floor. I was hoping I could go to the... Train, training facility. Here we go. I uh, just wanted to get an idea of how many ink ribbons we had. Okay. Okay. Save again. Just do it. I was hesitant to save because I didn't want to run low on ink ribbons, but just 
We, we have enough that it's fine. I don't want to have to redo things if I can help it. And we're about to go through a room. Yes. That's going to be hard to survive. We'll leave her there for now. I know we'll need her. We're probably going to have to send her through. But for now, let's just leave Rebecca behind. So there was this room over here. Over here that I know has gas in it, but there's also a zombie, but it's also one zombie. Which handgun ammo do we have? Just thinking it'd be nice to get Molotov cocktails. Have an extra. Oh no, it's a monkey! Like, why does the zombie sound like that? Why does he sound so sinister? And why does he move in so fast? Damn it. Oh, yeah. Good thing I saved, because I don't think we're going to make it through this room without getting killed. I was ready to start shooting, but... Oh, you are on the move. Why do you require so many shots? Jesus. Probably missed one of those times or two or three of those times. Is that it though? Weren't there more guys in here? Did we actually really take them all out with this? I was gonna say, I don't really trust it. Since I'm in here, I don't think there's anything else I could do in this kitchen, but I just want to check again, just to be sure. I do remember coming in here and being very disappointed. Thinking, uh, wait, this is really all you could do? All right. Well, There is that one room that has more ammo that I have not gone to. And it has gasoline, too, but there are two zombies in there. I wonder if I could just go in and out, get the ammo. Like, I don't want to go in there for ammo and then end up having to use some. We can try that. We can try it. It's that room that I went through to try to save Rebecca those first couple of times when I got killed by those monkeys that they were in the, they were in that room that I didn't even need to go into it's just right around this corner here oh yeah Billy is one little stub of a pinky toe away from death grab it quickly please oh shit is that gonna be our inventory Why did I not remember to check that beforehand? Yeah, because now they're getting up. Why did I not check that? Oh, I'm mad at myself. Uh, leave that. I really... I need it, you know? I need it. Can I do it? Can I make it in here and get that without getting accosted? I can't see him. Oh. oh. One more, one more, baby. One more, one more. Oh, okay, we're almost home. Go, go, go. Oh, he was there. <laughs> Did you see him? He was right there. Okay. And now we can actually send... Uh... Rebecca. I like gas is there. I'll just have to remember that if I need to make more Molotov cocktails. She has some empty bottles on her, I think, so we can make more. 
Um, also, I was told to give them to her, give the Molotov cocktails to her because she throws faster, apparently. So, uh, but yeah, we can send her back up since the way is now clear. So maybe we just do that now. I need my pack mule. Look, Rebecca, last time you came through here. Actually, if you came through here at all, I don't think you had. Well, that door's open. I did it. I opened that door. I've checked out this corner, right? Okay, there's nothing. Wait, oh, there is the thing here, though. Oh, I mean, that's for poison, but there's a red herb. But you had to pack me all. Oh, she's got the grenade launcher. Of course. God damn it. Well, uh, we can either do the old try to remember it's there or drop something off and then come back. Look, it's safe. You can run through here without having to worry. <laughs> I think we should go get it. But damn. There was a red herb in there. And, uh, yeah, you might as well just leave that. I probably won't have you use it. Okay, I think I'm going to go get the red herb. I'm going to go get the gasoline, but I'll make a cut because I'm already spending a lot of time doing inventory management. And that's boring. So we'll see you in a second once we're all inventory management settled. Inventory has been managed. I have a key. Obviously, I don't know off the top of my head where... I what it unlocks, but uh, it's called a facility key. Doesn't really help me though. There are some doors I haven't been able to get to. Uh, this one has been locked to me, so I was thinking maybe we go try that. Maybe this key unlocks that. If not, uh, there's also, I don't remember exactly what this was. Then there's also this. What is that item? Oh, a knife. Huh. I think I picked that knife up near there and that's why. It's kind of reminding me of that moment in RE1 where uh, as Jill, you pick up that knife and I'm like, why would I want this after you kill that giant spider? And then it's like, oh, you use that to uh, cut the spider web in front of the door. Okay, so it is this way. So yeah, we'll see if this key gets us through this room. Hopefully it does, because then we'll be able to access a lot of other rooms. Forgot. I'm like, oh, who's in here now? That wasn't in here before, but it's all those bugs upstairs. We might have to deal with them. Ah! And that's the only thing that it was good for, which is always nice, because then, then, then we don't have to find another door for it. Okay. Careful. No, not him! Shit. Apparently the Molotov cocktails are good for them, but I still don't even want to try when you just look at my health. Papers look like they once contain images of something, but they've long since deteriorated, deteriorated beyond use. Downstairs. Uh huh, uh huh. What are we doing? Oh, oh god. Just seeing if we can maybe. Ah. Just run past him. Just run past him, Billy. <laughs> 
I don't know if that was the only thing in there. It looked like it. But now we gotta deal with this guy. That's the strategy. Just run past. Piano. Covered with dust, but looks playable. Play the piano? No, not yet, not yet. We will. Let's just see what else we do in this room first. Okay, it looks like nothing, but hold on. Be thorough here. Can we get around the bar this way? Nope. All right, well. Yeah, I guess we give it a try. Oh, look at him go! Wow, good job, Billy! I wonder what would have happened with Rebecca, because, um... If you guys didn't know, I started a Chris playthrough of RE1 on uh, stream. And... I got to the piano room... And then Rebecca walks in because Chris couldn't play the piano. So Rebecca walks in. She tries to play. Okay, there's a magnum. I don't know. Probably just a single. That's why I said A. Um, oh, there's eight. Okay. We still need the gun. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so Rebecca walks in while Chris is trying to play and she offers to help him. Oh, here's that battery we needed. We don't have any space. We could drop stuff, of course. And there's empty bottles on the floor. Ugh, Jesus Christ. So many decisions to be made. So anyway, I wonder if you were playing as Rebecca right there, she would have been able to play on the first try. Hold on. There's another room right outside this door that we want to explore. Slime man's gonna try to get us. Ooh, I think we go to the out and then go directly to the right. Should have opened the map first, actually. Okay. He was waiting for me. I was thinking, like, I could send Rebecca, but then she's gotta try to get around him. What's this? Nothing I can actually read. Door behind me. It's accessible. What's through here first? Okay, just another door. So this is nothing but a hallway. You'd think this big poster on the wall would be something we could read. I guess not. Just a little decor. Come We're waiting. Mm-hmm. Just as I suspected. It's like the guy to the right uh, doesn't get back up. What? That's okay. You'll get back up twice for the sake of that guy not getting back up at all. Where's this magnum? I want it. Yeah, we'll reload while we wait a second. I think we're okay. This is just uh, very anxiety-inducing, running around with our health so low. The more progress we make, too, because I'm like, if I die now, then I'm going to have to load back longer than it was when I first saved. I mean, that's how time works, you know, but... The vice is gripping a tablet. The handle is missing, rendering the vice unusable. I don't even know what you're looking at. Okay, now I can see better. <laughs> the handle is that... That thing I picked up here? Oh, yeah, it is. Weird that I wouldn't need to use it now. I haven't examined it. Do I need to do that? So it will allow you to operate the vise. To be honest with you guys, I don't know what a vise is. Were you just not positioned correctly? Yes, that's exactly what it was. Oh! 
Wow, we've got two. And we know where the... Yeah, we know where the third one is. I just haven't been able to access it. But once I get that battery, I should be able to. I think I'm going to risk sending good old Becky up here. Taking the red herb. Can you even take the red herb? Like, that doesn't... I mean, I'm going to find out by experimenting. That's not going to improve their health at all, right? Yeah, you can't even do it. Kind of wonder if I should just have her... Keep it on her in case we do find a green herb to combine it with, but... I mean, there's so many items we have to pick up. And I have her holding the shotgun. I don't know. Well, we just exhausted all those rooms, didn't we? And we didn't find any more herbs. Uh, it, okay, so there is that other room he hasn't gone through yet. Okay. Well... Yeah, maybe we just have her put the shotgun down. And bring the red herb with us in case we do find another green one. Should we? Ugh, crap. Should we have her try to kill the slime guys with the Molotov cocktails? Like, instead of trying to evade them, because she's got to go a decent amount of the way past them, you know? I'm just... She's gonna get fucking killed. I feel like maneuvering could get her killed. Standing and fighting could get her killed. It's a tough call. I'm gonna go with trying to kill them, though. Because it would make it better for Billy's sake, too. Trying to run back through those hallways. I wish I could see him. How many times have I died today? Jesus. Um, okay. We're gonna... Resident Evil Zero. Redo that. Just give it a little retry. We haven't accomplished too much. I mean, the, the biggest reason I wanted her to come is so that I had a uh, inventory. I'm wondering if I just leave behind some stuff. Yeah, I feel like the extra ammo would be good. I don't know what we're going to do with this just yet, so leave it. Uh, we can't, we're not, we need all three of them before we can do anything with that, so leave it. So that gives us three slots. The key will discard after we use it. And with that, let's just go. I don't know if this is going to be enough. It was the same situation where, like, I can't see them and I don't want to just start wasting the very limited amount of supplies that I have on on the wall, you know? Like, for all I know, she's making contact, but I don't know. Yes, that's right. He's in here, which is fine. We just gotta grab this. Oh, crap! This isn't what I wanted! Oh my god! Grab the item! <laughs> Then go! I can't. We're gonna end up getting killed. Oh, that was close. Every time the camera angle changed, he turned around. I'm like, no, we don't want to befriend him, Billy. Just trust me on this. Go that way! <laughs> getting so stressed. <laughs> okay. 
And then... There's nobody in here, right? Yes. Play the piano. We can skip it because we don't need to see that again, as beautiful as it was. Yeah, should take it. I think we'll just leave the bottles behind. Yes, we left it last time, we'll take it this time. Oh no, it's one of these situations. We're gonna need something else. This looks like it's about the right shape. <laughs> yeah, I have no clue what's even going to be in there. I mean, what? <laughs> I have no clue. Um... what what item we're gonna grab to uh replace that with i'm gonna shoot these guys Why did you not go down? Why? That guy went down with like fucking two bullets last time. Resident Evil Zero. Now. Oh god. Oh yeah, let's take this. Since we have the room for it. Where is he? I can't tell. Okay, just leave him. We don't need to come back in here. I don't think. Okay. Now we haven't been in here yet, so this is new. It's a room full of heels. There is really a heel. Can you believe it? Oh my God. It's a first aid spray. Use it right now. <laughs> Billy's fun! There are more heels! Oh my god. <laughs> I can't believe it. I was totally joking when I said it's a room full of heels. There's another empty bottle. Oh, empty bottles. Too bad he can't combine the, these suckers. There's another one down here. Let me have it, please. So now his inventory is full. But what else do we do in here? This is purely to get us some meals. What's back here? There's an assortment of laboratory equipment. There doesn't seem to be anything of interest. Okay. There's gotta be more to this room. Almost all the equipment here looks badly worn. Some of the machines are even showing traces of rust. Really? This is it for this room? I'm like not, I keep interacting with the same things because I'm, I'm just not convinced yet. We can't take the empty bottle. All right. Interesting. I cannot believe his health is at fine. I didn't think we'd actually see that happen. Yeah, this something about this is weird. So this room right here on the map is the room that's got the piano, 
figured we'd leave it for now because I can't go in there and grab the battery anyway. Once we have what we need for that room, I can return, but yeah. In the meantime, I don't, I'm not sure what we do actually because We've got these two plaques, like the unity, discipline, whatever. That's only two. This is locked. This is locked. I'm thinking. We can always go back down to Rebecca, have her combine these herbs and give them to her to take so that we don't have to worry about her being on the verge of death. But otherwise, yeah, where else do we go? What have I not done? Where have I not been? Here, this is what's weird. It looks like a little box, like that tiny little room I was just in. I don't know, it just makes me think that there would be more to it. What, what is the point of having a whole room just... I mean, I guess they have done that with other rooms. Like, there's no quest items or anything in there. It's just stuff to help you restock. Yeah, all right, well. We've got more ammo. More shotgun ammo. we got these heals. we got this extra plaque, but... I don't know how we're going to get that battery. All right. Well. For now, we can go give that heal to Baxter's. Oh God. Can I go around? It's probably still fine because it's Billy, but. God, does that suck. No, no. I just healed myself, you asshole! No! I can't, can't get around him! Now he's probably back in danger. Oh my god, I'm ready to lose my mind. Oh, he's fine. <laughs> he's fine. But still, I mean, he's on the verge of not being fine. Like if he takes one more little hit, I bet you he will be in caution. And that just sucks because we just got him back to full health. It's not fair. So we are now in re-explore, the re-explore zone where we have to just return to places we've already been and see what we haven't done. That's what we did in the last part where I discovered that there was a bookshelf that you could move and I didn't, I hadn't moved it. And then, if I can give me the anchor, but I don't care. <gasps> They're both fine, can you believe it? Can't even believe it. Maybe what we do is We take, can't even tell what these things on the floor are here. Yeah. We take this and the second one and we put them down. What's this other thing? Oh, the briefcase. Yeah, we got to open that. Maybe, I mean, it looks kind of small, but maybe the thing to replace the batteries in there, but I just got to get the code. I really do wonder if I've gotten the code. Um, okay. We'll try to avoid the bugs. We'll go up these stairs and then we'll see if we can throw these plaques down really quick. I don't think the game's going to reward me with anything unless we have all three. But at least we don't have to worry about carrying them around anymore, I suppose. Nice. Good job, Bills. Got through that without getting hit at all. God, we're 
gonna have to go past those slime guys again, unfortunately. And that sucks. Was it here? Yeah, it was. Uh, do we need to place them in the right order? Or is it gonna do it for us? Let's just put it in the first one, so I don't know. Okay. I just happened to grab the one that goes first. First. So they're in the spot they need to go in. We don't have to worry about doing that later. We made some progress. And then this door was locked, right? But there does seem to be a... There just doesn't seem to be a keyhole anywhere. So the other plaque, it's outside, like out front. And there's an elevator out there that we can't operate without a battery. I've located the battery. But I don't know what to replace the battery with. I can't take it or the door shuts. Wait a second. Maybe, oh, I was, I was saying this could be a team effort. Um, sucks that we got to deal with these fucking guys. Go ahead, Bills. Um, I was saying about Rebecca in and, and RE1 and Chris and the piano. I wonder what would happen if you had her do it. Oh, God, please evade them. Get on the stairs, hurry! Oh, they can't get you on the stairs. Um, yeah, I was saying that. Just go in here for now. Um, the thing with the piano, I wonder if that we both go in there and then she plays the piano, or maybe she can't play it. Well, we're gonna find out. We're gonna deal with the slime guys. At least we have full health. Yeah, let's do it. Get those cocktails prepared. Oh, and also we have handgun, or I mean shotgun ammo. Billy picked up some. Does he still have it on him? Oh, he does. Well, she's got the shotgun, but we're gonna try to kill those guys with the Molotov cocktails. We can just try to move maneuver around them. It's doable, but Billy didn't do a good job with that last time. On the way back, at least. Maybe coming through would be okay, but... There's just too much trouble. We're just gonna try to kill him with the cocktails. Alright. You stay here for now, Billy. I know he can shoot while she does this, but I'd rather... Ugh. It's just too annoying. I'm trying here. I'm really trying. How about a light bud defeat Mimi Cry Marcus with a Molotov cocktail or napalm? And she's in. Uh, is that orange caution? I'm not colorblind, but I'm having a hard time. Yeah. Just like that. <laughs> All right, Billy. Now we're going to test out Rebecca's piano skills. Oh, wrong, wrong, wrong door. <laughs> okay. Going to test them out. See what happens here. This way. Okay. And if we can get the battery, we can get that third plaque. And that would be swell. Okay, but I want to, I want Rebecca to play the piano first. Move, move bills. Play the piano? Yes. Can she do it? Oh, 
Billy was better. That's so funny. Oh, she got frustrated. She's me playing this game. Calm the zombie nerves. Play the piano using Rebecca. That's so funny. I wouldn't have gotten that achievement. Well, I mean, I guess you have to. Well, maybe not. You don't have to actually try that. Oh, so much better. <laughs> That's so funny with the little feature and RE1. Um, because she, because you have to leave the room and come back as Chris, so she can practice. Okay, so Bills, you stay here while Rebecca. Nope. I'll go. Okay. Yeah. While Rebecca <laughs> grabs it. Hi, Billy. How much space does she have? She has one slot. I want to take these items. I hate the thought of just leaving them here. Now you play that piano again. Nice. Now, uh, Bills, you come over here, grab that. You have room, right? Yes, thank goodness. And let's see. Oh, we have an ink ribbon on him. Um, yeah, give it to Billy. I think I'm satisfied with that. This way. Roger. Both of us come through here. Oh, we don't gotta worry about the slime guy. We don't have to go back through those other rooms, right? I don't think I left anything in there. Oh no! Bunch of leech dudes. Leeches. God, please don't let them be in this room also. Okay, I think we're fine. Okay, so we'll go to the elevator. Just with Billy. We're taking them both to the main room though. Come on, Becky. That is not a place you want to hang out. They can't, the, the giant bug guys can't go down the stairs, but still. You just don't want to hang out there. Well, at least she's not in danger, I guess. All right. I'll go alone. Roger. Out the front door. There was nothing out here dangerous, right? Do you see the plaque right here? Um, yeah, we gotta get a the box that's on that elevator. Nice. Use the lift? Yes, please. Give me that box. I don't. I don't know exactly how this is gonna go. I don't know if we climb, like we we slide the box over. I don't know how he would even like. They don't pull things, you know. So. Can he climb down the other end and? Yes, he can and push it. Okay. So I do know how this is gonna work. Can you come over here, please? Thank you. Nice work, muscles. Okay. 
I mean, I don't know if he's going to be able to reach that. It looks like it's still pretty high. But we're going to try. What? Keep going. Oh, I think it's stuck here. I'm going to move. Move it over a tad. My bad, Bills. I didn't realize. Okay, that's got to be good. Yeah, can you push it further? Might as well. There's something here. Indeed there is. Alright. Now. Do I want to save? I mean, yeah, obviously I do, but... We have an ink ribbon on us. And there's one in this room. What about upstairs? Oh, there's two up there. Hell yeah. Go ahead and save. Go to that typewriter, Bills. We're gonna save and then we're gonna go put this down. Because I have no idea what's gonna happen once we're done with that. Um, yeah, for all we know, the leech guy comes out of nowhere and he's like, you are trespassing still. My monkeys taught you nothing. Release the nuclear bomb on this place, and then we gotta fight up a nuclear bomb, and it's just a mess. Do you think maybe we should be extra safe here? I mean, drop these, honestly. Don't know when we'll be able to use that. Yeah, let's just have the shotgun on us. And, uh... Let's do the extra shells, but we can at least leave these. Oh, no, you know what? Don't leave them on the ground. No. Give them to Bex. Yep. And keep the handgun equipped, though. Like I said, I have no idea what's going to happen when we put this third plaque down, so I figured we should just try to be a little prudent. So the briefcase that I picked up, that has nothing to do with uh, that battery. You know, that's fine and all. I wasn't like desperate for it to have something to do with the battery. Ooh, don't get stuck on that pillar, please. <laughs> they had to put that pillar right there, didn't they? <laughs> I think when we put these down, that door is probably going to get unlocked. But what's beyond the door? All three, baby. Oh my god. Look at the shape of that building. Water. Remember the water motives? Training facility complete. Complete the training facility. Cool. <laughs> That's the achievement. Uh, if you see me just reading things, well, I'm sure a lot of you guys are familiar with that sound. The steam achievement sound. They don't show up on the game. What's through here? What is it? Oh, birds. Oh, we're in like a whole new section. Before we go in there, what's over here? Something that's going to attack me? Hmm. What about this way? Oh. Figured we'd just look around out here before trying to go through that door. For all I know, I can't even go in that door. But it doesn't seem to be getting any power. Hold on. This is locked. Okay. 
kind of creepy out here. Locked from the other side. That's okay. I didn't even see. I just saw the button, but now I'm seeing that this is an elevator door. All right. Well, we have explored the outside to the extent that we are currently allowed. So let's. Oh. Okay. I was gonna say. So let's go through here now. Never mind. Hmm. I'm thinking this room is our only other. Oh. Poke? Uh. Rebecca, we need you! Alright, you know what? I think this is actually a good place to wrap up for today. I think we've made a lot of progress. We died a lot. So I appreciate your patience. Um, I hope that you understand i hope that this isn't not that i want you guys to struggle when you play games and you know get frustrated but i i would imagine that it's pretty common for people to die as often as i've died here i'm not saying i'm amazing at video games or anything but <laughs> i didn't die this often in re1 if you came here from that playthrough then you'll know that, that is true not that i was great but i didn't die this often this game is particularly hard when it comes to that stuff so uh i hope that you um don't get too frustrated with me on that and can understand but either way frustrated or not i appreciate you being here and watching and hanging out it's always um really great to see you guys are enjoying this playthrough because i'm really enjoying it myself so that's really special but thank you again I'll see you in the next one, and I hope that you have an amazing day. <laughs> Bye.